person's faith, true saving faith, will evidence itself in the way we live our lives. You'll see the fruit of it. This fruit, the fruit of the Spirit that's manifested in our lives. People will recognize that and see it. What is your attitude towards what they call Christian liberty? Oh, I can do it because I'm under grace. Do we befriend, accept, or even defend the things of this world, especially today? The things of this world have set themselves up against the Word of God, which means they set themselves up against God Himself. Is the church becoming a mixed marriage between the principles of God and the principles of this world? Family, we cannot have our feet in both worlds. Oil and water do not mix. Godly principles and worldly principles and things do not mix. They should separate. Amen? And notice I didn't say have nothing to do with the people of the world. We ought to have what to do with the people of the world. We ought to bring the gospel of salvation to the lost. We ought to be witnesses and ambassadors for Christ. But we go and we share the truth in love so that they come and know Jesus Christ and Lord and Savior. Not all things are good. Sometimes there are tests, trials, struggles, but God is molding us like gold and fire, getting rid of the impurities. He's molding us. But in the end, He wants us to be like Jesus. He wants us to be Jesus to others. So we might have to purge some of that stuff, or even in the midst, taking a godly saint and letting them go through something so difficult that'll place them in an area where in that godliness they'll share the gospel with people who have never heard it.